Man, I worked really hard on that last video. I wonder how it's doing. Here, let me check my YouTube account. So basically I got a copyright strike on my latest video that isn't up anymore called Voice Acting 101 Sword Art Online Edition, right? And this is all my fault and here I'm going to play a little bit uh, of a clip without the uh, footage of course um, for, you know, copyright reasons. Oh, oh nice try buddy! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so that was uh, what I uploaded, and so uh, I uploaded the video after spending all night with my friend, right? We stayed up uh, all night recording this video, right? And, uh, you know, doing the voice acting, right? And I did the editing, all of that, right? And then I uploaded it uh, to YouTube, right? And it came back with a copyright complaint. It was banned uh, in all countries, uh, including the United States. And I was really upset because obviously I, I just spent all night on that video. And I'm like, look, I distorted the image. It was flipped over. I removed all the original audio in the uh, episode from Sword Art Online. And I also, like, gave you guys uh, credit. I gave the owner's credit of the video right i'm like look we're just making a parody of it you know i don't think which i don't think there's anything wrong with that right but basically it is wrong so what i did was i went to uh file a complaint to like the copyright right so basically when you get a copyright uh complaint and i didn't get a copyright strike at this point right when they say this includes copyright content, you cannot uh, view this video. No one can view the video. Basically, you can say, oh wait, no, I think you're wrong uh, because this, right? So I'm like, yeah, I just told them what I did with the video. I said, it's just simply a parody. I think you are wrong, right? So basically I uh, sent them that request for it to not be copyright anymore. And it went against what they were talking about. Well, uh, it worked for like 
few days. Uh, and the video was public to all countries and people saw it. Uh, but just recently, like two days ago, I went back on my YouTube channel. Uh, not my YouTube channel. I went back to YouTube. Um, and it was on a homepage. And it said that there was something with copyright and my video got taken down and had to go to copyright school and I'm like what so I go click on my channel and it's well taken over because I basically I lost features from my channel Oops. I lost features from my channel I can't I couldn't upload I couldn't do anything couldn't look at my subscribers can't look at my analytics couldn't do any of that right because of the copyright so I could not do that until I did copyright school and I was furious obviously because it was taken down and I don't think I was I didn't think at the time that I was rightly accused of copyright you know because I'm like if you can make parodies of a song you should be able to make a parody of a TV show right but that isn't the case so I took the copyright school and completed that and it it did teach me a lesson, you know, it, it did teach me a lesson because what I did was take their show and I still distorted it. Even like, even though I distorted it, it didn't mean anything. It didn't mean jack. So even though I, you know, flipped the image around and removed all the audio, the creator still has the right to take down the show. And the reason why I think Sword Art Online Voice Acting 101 was taken down and not the other, the first Voice Acting 101 I did uh, is because of the fact that the show is so much well known. Uh, it was taken down by Sony Entertainment in Japan, um, while the other one's more of a low key sort of company. So I, I, I think that the the company being a lot more well known also like uh, really got me in trouble and another point was like I I saw clips of people um, uploading like little clips of on uh, sort of online can't talk sorry people people are uploading clips of sort of online there was like a 43 minute video of like sort of online funny moment and it was like 43 minutes long. I'm like, how are they allowed to do that? But when I do a parody, you know, it, it gets taken down. And for that, I, I still don't know because unless they got permission, but yeah. So for the voice acting 101, uh, you may not see it as much because for now one, I'm going to either go through the company's rules and see if I am allowed to use it. And if I'm not, I'm going to, like, if I don't see it there, uh, I am not, if I don't see it there, I'm going to send a message to them. I'm going to email them and ask them for permission. So, and I'm going to keep that email. So if they do decide to take it down, I actually have like proof, uh, that I have permission so yeah so unfortunately the voice acting 101 uh, unless it's like with a game you know like Gmod uh, I don't know the anime voice acting 101 is either gonna stop or it's gonna really like slow down because I planned on making a lot of videos but now I have to like either ask permission or like go through all the rules of their show you know what's allowed and what's not allowed like obviously with the other show that I used for my first voice acting it was allowed you know and obviously I don't make money off this I don't make money off of YouTube so that's fine um, so that was allowed and they got their money for my video which is fair enough right but with a sort of online you know it was not the case so for now on, uh, I don't want to get any more copyright strikes, so 
Uh, I'm gonna pause the. Uh, I'm gonna pause the voice acting 101 for a little bit and just either ask permission or go through the rules and you know uh, go from there. But if you're not seeing the uh, voice acting 101s anymore, that is why. So yeah, I mean, I feel like copyright strikes or the thing you kind of keep to yourself but I, I realized that it's going to change the content on my channel I'm going to be a lot more careful now especially like music I, I use and all of that because if I get two more if I get two more copyright strikes with, within the three months I'm done for I can't even make a new account so uh, I'm going to be very very careful so, and by the way, the music from the intro is going to be in the link in the description. I don't own that music. I heard it and I'm like, wow, that's pretty dank. So, yeah. And yeah, I'm allowed to use it, by the way. So anyway, guys, I uh, hope you understand my little thing. Uh, so, yeah. Have a great day. Subscribe. I guess. I guess you can like if you want. I don't really care. Alright guys. Hope you have a great day.